We didn't really talk about this when we, when we made the almond cookies, but professional bakers do something they call, they mise out their ingredients. It's called, uh, it's M-I-S-E. And if you really want to feel organized and you want to make sure that you have every ingredient you need, it's a good idea to do this. So I've kind of started here. I know in the recipe that I need X amount of butter. So I've softened my butter and put that out on one plate. I know that I need um, three-fourths cup brown sugar. So I set that out. Um, I'm actually going to need two eggs. So I'm just going to set those out. And I'm going to measure my flour out. I'm going to be using two cups of flour. So again, the flour measuring, you just want to scoop the flour really lightly into the cup. You don't want to pack it down. And then scrape it off so you have an even amount. Okay, so we're going to put that into that bowl, our second cup. And so this way, when you get ready to bake, um, everything's going to go really easily because you've already set out the amounts you need. You can just toss them in the bowl. And when you're be a beginning baker or if you're needing to bake a lot of cookies, this can uh, save you a lot of time. And then we're going to need a half a cup of cocoa. So let's get that set up. And you'll feel very professional measing out all your ingredients. Okay, so our cocoa's ready. We have our salt. We're just gonna have that all ready to go. And last, we just have our bag of sugar, and I'm just gonna leave that in the bag. But you can just see you set out all the ingredients, and you're not running to the cupboard and being like, I'm out of baking soda. Um, because then you have to run to the store, your cookies will fall flat. You'll cry. You won't get those warm home-baked cookies that you've been craving all day. So um, you want to prep. And that's what we did here. And that's going to make this process go a lot smoother.